Your luckiest day of the week is here for each zodiac sign. The week of August 26th brings enormous change into your life and a dramatic energy shift. You can understand the importance of never giving up hope or working to manifest your heart's desires. Before we get into the video, please give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel if you're new. Now let's begin. Aries. Luckiest day for Aries, Sunday, September 1st. The possibilities for growth are endless, dear Aries, as Uranus stations retrograde in Taurus on Sunday, September 1st. Uranus is all about unexpected opportunities, and in Taurus, it will not only bring in new ways to generate income, but it will also help you learn that you are worthy of the best. Use this time to explore starting that business side or view finances differently. Uranus retrograde invites you to explore what is unconventional and take a risk, so don't shy away from either during this time. You are moving through a complete renovation of yourself and your life, so take your time, but also be open to receiving that financial boost you currently need. Taurus. Luckiest day for Taurus, Monday, August 26th. Nurturing your dreams through new experiences is your top priority, Taurus. As asteroid series stations directly in Capricorn on Monday, August 26th, you will begin to look at life differently. This means less fear around relocating, trying a new experience, or even diving deeper into your spiritual practice. As you begin to see that the greatest home is the one within, you also allow yourself to live that life that is calling to you. Travel, especially international, is highly favored around this time, and even spending significant time with another culture or group you can learn from. Instead of being cramped up in an office, you are invited to learn more about yourself and your purpose in this life through experiences, so be open to what arises and be sure to keep listening to your intuition. Gemini. Luckiest day for Gemini, Wednesday, August 28th. While Mercury retrograde can be challenging for anyone, it has been especially difficult for you, dear Gemini. Mercury shifted into Leo during the second half of its retrograde and into your house of communication. That means while it's been incredibly difficult to trust your thoughts or communicate clearly, all that is about to change. As Mercury stations directly in Leo on Wednesday, August 28, you will start to feel more like yourself. Your quick thinking and adaptability will return, along with your not taking no for an answer. Use this time to wrap up loose ends, follow up on career possibilities, and let yourself sign any agreements. While you needed this time for reflection so you could be sure about what it is you really want, you are now in the position to finally go after it. Cancer. Luckiest day for Cancer. Wednesday, August 28th. As Mercury stations direct in Leo on Wednesday, August 28th, if any financial difficulties come to a close, you will start receiving new opportunities to attract abundance into your life. Mercury in this area of your life represents a time when financial offers or even gifts will be entering your life, but it also means that you may have to speak up and assert what you deserve. This Mercury retrograde invited you on a long journey to start learning and honoring your worth, which means now you shouldn't hold back from asking for what you want. When you can believe in yourself and raise the price of your talents, and even for those who have access to you, you live more in alignment with your truth and start to manifest more of what you want for your life. Leo. Luckiest day for Leo. Monday, August 26th. Choose to let go of what no longer resonates, dear Leo. The last quarter moon in Gemini is about a time of release and what is taking up precious space in your life. At this time, you should reflect on the circle of people surrounding you and whether or not their influence is helping you on your path. You will become most like the three people you spend time with, so if you don't want to become like your friend or partner, then it's time to do a little soul weeding. When you realize that it's better to be surrounded by a few of value than a crowd of plenty, you will find achieving your dreams even easier. This pruning of your life may even extend into situations outside of personal relationships, so be wise about choosing to take only what resonates with you into the future. Virgo. Luckiest day, 
for Virgo Thursday August 29. Everything should feel more effortless and as if each move you make is a lucky one, dear Virgo. Especially as Venus returns to Libra on Thursday August 29. Venus governs over finances, real estate, and love, and in Libra. It's all about living that life of abundance you've always dreamed of. This can represent a turning point in your financial journey, as well as the relationship you have with yourself. During this time, the idea is to focus your energy on creating a sustainable path to manifest what you desire, whether it's more money in your career, selling a property, or even upgrading your romantic life. While you can often struggle with what you deserve, Venus in Libra will help with that, as it will feel more natural to make decisions based on how you want to live rather than how you currently are. As long as you remember how deserving you are of a life of wealth, then that is precisely what you will attract during this phase. Libra. Luckiest day for Libra. Monday, August 26th. Nothing is standing between you and the life you want to live, Libra. So it's also time to let go of those excuses that only serve to waste valuable opportunities. The last quarter moon in Gemini will rise on Monday, August 26th, joining Jupiter in this dynamic air sign. Jupiter will help you embrace new adventures and experiences this year. Still, this last quarter moon is about letting go of the excuses or fears preventing you from seizing new possibilities in your life. You are the only one who can free yourself, Libra, but you first have to see how some limited thinking creates an obstacle to your dream's life. By releasing your excuses, fears, doubts, and even those crazy what-if situations, you will be better able to break out of your shell and manifest the abundance and luck that is meant to be yours. Scorpio. Luckiest day for Scorpio. Wednesday, August 28th. While it may have felt challenging to remain patient, Scorpio, you are about to understand why it takes time to bring about miracles in your life. Mercury will station directly in Leo on Wednesday, August 28, and will help propel your career path and make it feel as if your dreams are starting to come true. After a bit of delay and some reflection, you are now moving into a fascinating time in your professional life where you should start showing off all your skills and talents. Sign on for that big project, take that job, or apply for something that aligns with your newfound worth. Instead of avoiding the limelight, take the step to step into it. Anything related to your career is favored around this time, and by moving forward, you will understand why patience always does pay off and what it feels like to finally have confirmation that you are precisely where you are meant to be. Sagittarius Luckiest day for Sagittarius, Monday, August 26th. Instead of only thinking about finances determining your worth, Sagittarius, it may be beneficial to start reflecting on how you care for and treat yourself. Ceres will station directly in Capricorn on Monday, August 26th, and direct your thoughts toward nurturing and caring for yourself in all the ways you need. You have been so busy working on your dreams, career changes, and even new developments in your romantic life that you have overlooked some of your own needs. Take time to understand how your care for yourself sets the tone for what you receive. Prioritize your time, so whether it's rest, finally scheduling that doctor's appointment, or even cutting toxic people out of your life, you demonstrate that you are worthy of caring for yourself and taking the time you need to feel your best. Capricorn. Luckiest day for Capricorn. Thursday, August 29th. Remember that to achieve the success you desire, Capricorn, all you must do is be yourself. While at times that can be easier said than done, once Venus returns to Libra on Thursday, August 29th, you will have the charm of the divine behind you and will be able to manifest all you desire. Venus in Libra highlights your career sector, casting you in a positive aura of confidence, skill, and luck so that you find the success and recognition that you deserve. Venus represents finances, so this would be an excellent time to focus on generating more income through your current role or even a new one. With Libra energy being activated during this time, you may also want to focus on working with others and networking. 
while you will have a certain something about you during this time, you are guided to take advantage of that and use it to build your professional relationships. There is no reason it has to be lonely at the top, Capricorn, no matter how much you once believed that. Aquarius. Luckiest day for Aquarius. Thursday, August 29th. Promise yourself, Aquarius, that you will not settle for less than loving every minute of your life. As Venus moves into Libra on Thursday, August 29th, it will highlight themes of your house of luck. It will help you attract more money, travel opportunities, and even the willingness to explore a relationship with the divine. Aquarius, you are meant to explore it if it feels like it moves your soul. With Venus in Libra, you will feel more confident as you will be connected not only to your purpose but also to your life. During this time, you will be able to create more of the life you desire. Even if it means you take a risk or two, it will be worth it, as you will learn to fall even more deeply in love with yourself. Whether single or attached, be on the lookout for an exotic love, especially if you are traveling, as this energy favors long-distance relationships and finding love in even the most unexpected places. Pisces. Luckiest day for Pisces. Sunday, September 1st. Be ready to open up to the world and start communicating in new and exciting ways. Dear Pisces, once Uranus stations retrograde in Taurus, in your house of communication, there is a unique opportunity to overhaul your communication style, social media, or even how you present yourself to the world. Understand that just because a particular way works doesn't mean it is the best. When you open yourself up to receiving help and looking at communication with a new perspective, you might find that how you show up makes all the difference in what you attract. Don't let any old fears, especially around stepping into the spotlight, make you shy away from this opportunity. Especially as it's connected to part of the boost to your income that you are on track to receive. 